from the IHTN studios, it's Braves Beat. Hi, I'm Emma Beck. And I'm Escher Weinstein. Um, Emma, what year is it? 2017? Yes! The machine worked. I'm 50 years in the past. Asher, you're not actually a time traveler. It's just National Pretend to be a Time Traveler Day. I'm not convinced. I mean, come on, look at our names. Anyway, let's get on with the news. First of all, we want to congratulate the November recipients of the Super Brave Awards. Keep up the great work and keep on reminding us about what it means to be a Brave. The winner of the Super Brave for November was Merritt McMullen. Congratulations, Merritt. In the season of giving, remember the children in need at Price Hill School. From December 4th to the 12th, there will be boxes in the lobby of each school to collect the needed items to share the warmth, which includes coats, gloves, hats, scarves, boots, blankets, new underwear and socks, any size that fits a K-6 through child, any child size suitcase with wheels, any sweatshirts or sweaters, and any, any gently used Beanie Babies. Let's see which school can donate and share the brave spirit the most. Thank you for helping to make a difference in our city. For more information, contact this email. This past Friday, you may have noticed that the IH Robotics Club was missing. Turns out they didn't all call in sick. They were actually visiting Live Oaks for a robotics scrimmage. Teams spent the day finalizing their robot design and competing against one another in an obstacle-filled arena. Let's take a look at some pictures from the event. Last year, the robotics team were state finalists in the Ohio VEX Robotics Competition, and you can see them compete this year on January 27th at Scarlet Oaks. Good luck, guys. After last week's season debut for the women's team, the IH men's basketball team started off their season with a game at Anderson on Tuesday. The Braves took the win with a 43-29 score at Anderson. In addition to our basketball teams, our Indian Hill wrestling team also recently started their season, and they've gotten off to a great start. Over the weekend, the team wrestled one of the, some of the best teams in Kentucky at the Walton Verona Bearcat Brawl and placed second in the entire tournament. The team was led by Cooper Lestrick, John Mark Williams, and Dan Sheard. Great job, boys. This week is Teacher Appreciation Week, so let's go and see how you all have been showing appreciation to all your teachers. Hi Jasper, how's it going? It's good, thanks. So, uh, how do you show your teachers appreciation during Teachers Appreciation Week? Well, I mean, I show my appreciate, I show my teachers appreciation all the time because that's what that's what you should do. Telling them how much you appreciate them and doing well in your class, I guess. I thank them for teaching me, and I try to make them laugh. All right, everyone do that. That's a good way. I do my homework. You should always do that. Yeah, I do my homework too. Bro. Hi, Miss Smith. How's it going? Hey, I'm Ed. I'm doing great. How are you? I'm good. So, how do students show you appreciation during Teachers Appreciation Week? My students are wonderful in class. They do all their work and they have all straight A's. Just like Ahmed. Yeah. <laughs> I study extra hard. Uh, oh, Miss McFarlane, you know. Um, I give her hugs and uh, I give her Hershey kisses, not kisses kisses, and uh, I just don't act around in class because she's like a mother to me. How about you? We got uh, you know, Mr. Millard, Daddy Millard, he's the man. Um, just be respectful to, uh, to Mr. Millard. Obviously put, put forth my best effort in the classroom, like really show the teachers how much we appreciate them. They're awesome, keep up the good work. We love all of you. Peace. Indian Hill is putting on a fashion show. The money made from the fashion show will go to a charity called BEST, or Better Education for Stronger Teeth. It focuses on implementing oral health practices to children in impoverished areas. 
We are in need of designers for the fashion show. Email ih.charityfashionshow at gmail.com to be a designer for the show and for more information. Let's check in with Dakota's brand new weekly program. Just kidding. We're never, ever doing that again. <laughs> That's all we have for this week. Be sure to follow us on Twitter, subscribe to us on YouTube, see us on Snapchat, and email us with any school updates. Have a great weekend, Braves. And as always, stay, stay classy, classy, Indian, Indian Hill. Hill. Courtney Hall, what is your favorite number? <laughs> We're not doing this. What's my favorite number? Oh, that's classified. Four. Uh, three. My favorite number is seven. Nine. I. Let's go with a negative one. Sweet. My favorite number is three. <laughs> Leah, what is your favorite number? Three. Fourteen. One.